Welcome back everybody, we are the mighty champions of the second gym in your face, in your face. Alright, we are ready, we are getting down to the end of the line for Pokemon Orange. Trust me, it's been an amazing hack so far, really wish there was more to this. Again, it's only, I believe, Beta 2 and it has a rough English translation. Uh, we pretty much covered basically everything this hack has to offer, but there's still some areas where we, uh, we haven't explored just yet. So we're gonna go ahead and go over there. I don't think a uh, jump cut is necessary as it might be just our shortest episode yet. Uh, we're just gonna have to, oh wow, we're, well, oh, I forgot that we were low on health there. Guess I'm gonna have to use a jump cut, huh? Huh. Also, keep in mind, I swear, like, if I could count how many Corsolas came out in this ocean, I... I have no idea. The tally would be in the, in the, in the triple digits, because this is just ridiculous. Because you guys don't even see the off-screen action of how many Corsolas I encounter. And trust me, it is not as fun as it sounds. Um, where am I going? I, I, I'm serious, guys. I have, I'm having a hard time adjusting to what exactly is going on here. Oh, right, uh, we're going back into the cave. We're not going to explore the cave just yet, because if you remember in that one episode where I was trying to use Flash inside the cave, it said we had to get the second badge to be able to use it. Um, and the reason why that's important is because there's a part of the tunnel where you can't proceed in the darkness unless you have Flash, and that's because there's a, apparently like a Pokemon that uh, attacks us, basically. Or not attacks us, but like growls at us, and we're kind of scared of it to continue further. So, I, um, I also wanted, uh, something interesting to point out is, uh, that this cave is actually, um, since, you know, Brawly's the second gym leader and this is really a Ruby hack or, uh, using the Ruby engine, um, it's, all the randoms you encounter in here are essentially the same ones you encounter in that first cave on the island where, uh, Brawly's gym is. Like, there really is, like, nothing else here to do. I'm just gonna use a surf, because why not? Get away, Abra. You ain't gonna teleport away from me, son! Not this time, Abra. Not this time. But uh, yeah, the, the... the Sergio pretty much wanted to keep it the same, you know? And uh, he pretty much did that exactly. So we're out of this cave. This Kabuto's cave. I was about to stumble my words there. In fact, there's a lot of NPCs that still have the same... Uh, uh, captions as well. He has uh, some of these don't even have uh, changed captions, so it's a really, relatively speaking, uh, really, it's it's very unfinished. But um, trust me, as far as first first impressions goes, uh, first impressions goes, this game uh, did its work. It, it did amazing. I'm not gonna lie. I really wish that Sergio would continue make, uh, working on this hack, but I understand how much work it is to do in, even in the first place. So, you know, it happens. Um, but there are, like I said, there are still some things that are pretty much for us to finish. And I'm gonna go ahead and swim on over to what exactly we missed. Of course, we gotta pay ourselves a visit to the Pokemon Center, so on the way we should find one, I believe. Um, there was, uh, there's about three things I kinda wanna do. So the cave is one of them, right? Which we just passed, but I said we're gonna save that for later, probably the end. Uh, there is also another smaller area where there's other trainers. Uh, we can go to Mr. Barney's house, apparently, which probably won't be Mr. Barney's because the cap they didn't bother to change the captions. And, uh, if you recall that one, uh, Pokemon, I believe, uh, uh, the cool trainer guy with, like, six Pokemon, like a Trap Inch, uh, a Trap Inch, what else did he have? A Whale Lord? No, a Whalmer. Yeah, what else? Uh, he had a bunch of Pokemon, and I kind of hated him because he beat me. We're gonna go back to him, finish him off, because why not? We can't leave, uh, open doors trying to finish this story. We need a conclusion, and even then, even if this hack is not finished, we still need a conclusion, ladies and gentlemen. So we're gonna go down to this city, and, uh, we're gonna get ourselves, uh, some nice healed Pokemon, shall we? I'm gonna say hello to Nurse Joy for maybe one last time. Hello, Nurse Joy. It's been an amazing ride, Nurse Joy. It's funny how uh, this game kind of makes you, uh, at least ROM hacks, kind of make you forget like the things you take for granted. Like for example, um, 
We don't have running shoes, so that's why if people are wondering, like, why the heck is he just running? I mean, not running, just like walking around. We have no running shoes, and as far as I know, do we even have a bike? I don't think we do. I think I would have noticed if we had a bike. No, just just regular Pokemon balls. Yeah, uh, that would have happened, but uh, that's not. Um, where am I going? That's a good question, everybody. I believe we're going up there. I think. Don't quote me on that. <laughs> uh, I mean, come on, we're getting near the end of the game, so we gotta finish this. I mean, what's what is it up here? There's a piece of land and absolutely nothing. Well, time for a jump cut. <laughs> no jump cut needed, because all we had to do was just uh, walk on over here and face whatever is gonna face us. What? Uh, I hope this is a swimmer and not some fancy oh, um, youngster in the middle of the ocean. Hold on, what do you what do you have for us, Cola? What do you have for us? He gave us some uh, a pita. I don't know what that is. A soda, some kind. Let's uh, switch on Daisy to uh, what Lapras. Hello, head. There's a desert full of hard trainers. Please be careful. So this is the area I was talking about, a desert apparently. Uh, allowed only and for advanced trainers, interesting. Well, your badge says that you're quite good. It's good to see something like you. You mean somebody? Come on, guy. Uh, and then it goes back to Spanish. Aunque okay. victorioso de Pequito, mejor compruebo yo mismo. What? Compruebo? Uh, so he's testing us? Las medallas que no... So basically the badges don't count. I'm gonna judge you. Sorry for that broken Spanish, I just spat it out of my mouth. And hello, Greenmouth Ranger Eldro. What are you sending out, my friend? You are sending out a level 30 Machop. I wasn't ready, ladies and gentlemen. I was not ready. But I did land the sleep powder, so at least that, right? My lord, all these Pokemon are gonna be level 30s, huh? Well, Welp indeed. Can we even take three Pokemon with like all these guys? I'm not even sure, honestly, to tell you the truth. Resistant. I did a decent amount of damage, but he's still asleep. So he stays asleep, my lord. Come on, Ray Daisy. Get those razor leaves. Get some. Oh, I was about to say get a crit, and it happened. Why? That was uh, better than expected. Level 24. So uh, we're dealing with some hard trainers here. I'm, I'm probably gonna have to grind again. A Snorlax. Uh, interesting. Interesting. I have nothing for the Snorlax, huh? Send out a... Send out a Gold Duck. Let's see what he can do. Come on, Gold Duck. We got you towards like the last <laughs> of the other game, you know? The last one to join our team, basically. So we got Tail Whip Confu- Oh, right. He doesn't really have that much... Getting the confusion off. That did absolutely nothing, but he did the yawn. Making me all drowsy. Making me all sleepy. I am gonna go for the disable, so he's not gonna go for the yawn again. Uh, but he has headbutt. He does a significant amount of damage, actually. And our gold duck is now asleep. Welp. Uh, Lapras, our second highest. Can we just freeze this Snorlax, please, with a nice beam? And that would be quite lovely. Go for the headbutt. Oh wow. Uh, really? Disable? Okay, so Disable sucks in this game. Duly noted. Doesn't he have thick fat too? Come on now, Jamie. You should have known that. Oh my lord! This is, this is, this is, this Snorlax. This is Snorlax. I'm not liking this at all, ladies and gentlemen. I'm not liking this at all. Can we survive a headbutt, or whatever it has? Because I really don't know the moveset of the Snorlax. Really? Wow! You... Suck balls. Ah, damn it. Can we land a sleep hotter, please? My lord. Alright, so Snorlax is asleep. I'm gonna be asleep. This is just an exciting match of sleeping Pokemon. Wouldn't you agree? Uh, what does anybody have? My lord. I have nothing for this Snorlax. Uh, Pikachu, maybe you can do something? I don't know. I really have nothing. I have no fighting move. Like, whatsoever, and he wakes up and he's gonna go for the yawn. Ah, oh, wow. He went for the snore. Interesting. Interesting. 
Thunder Wave. I don't know what that would do. I mean, just paralyze him. He's already slow enough as it is, but we can get a chance for him to not do anything. Which would be quite helpful. And putting him to sleep won't help, because he's just gonna snore. How much will a Thunderbolt do? He did get the hacks, though, there. I hope this trainer doesn't heal up his Pokemon. This is taking too long. This is taking too long, ladies and gentlemen! Ah, <sighs> another T-Bolt to the belly of the beast. And a nice crit. I uh, used rest. Wow! Uh, we are... I have no words, ladies and gentlemen. I have no words. You shouldn't be allowed to rest when you're paralyzed! I call shenanigans! It's gonna go for snore, obviously. God. Look how much damage that did! My lord! This is too much. This is too much now. I'm gonna go for surf, see how much that does. Oh, that is quite annoying if I do say so myself. Going for the surf. Did meh damage. Went for snore, but it failed. Let's do another surf. Get a crit, hopefully, because I've been lucky on the crit so far. Always for the rest. Wow. We are playing those games. And they can't even disable, because disable only di disables it for two turns. Wow. Fantastic. Amazing! Not. This is really dumb. I'm gonna go for the confu uh, confuser right now. It says I snored doing my lapras. Not too much. All right. Uh, confuse this Snorlax, please, and then keep going for snores. I have to heal up and try to wake up some of our Pokemon while this guy's asleep and confused as well. Hit yourself. Hit yourself in your sleep, Snorlax. Hit yourself in your sleep, Snorlax. Yes. You freaking Snorlax rolled over and he crushed his arm because he's an idiot. There's no denying that. In the yellow, he woke up. He's still confused. Hit yourself again. Hit yourself again. Nope, nope, but it failed. That's that's even better. Come on, let's take down the Snorlax. Oh, crit, please hit yourself. I'm counting on- No! No, he's gonna use his rest. Oh! God, uh, so close. So close. This isn't fun. This is really silly. Let's just go for the pair song. Fuck the Snorlax. All right. All Pokemon will faint in three turns. <laughs> if this doesn't work, I don't know what will, ladies and gentlemen. I don't know what will. Snorlax is fall to three as well. I'm gonna go for another Confuse Ray. And then switch out to, I don't know, anybody that wants to kind of take a hit, essentially. If a Snorlax doesn't, uh, you know, you snore, please Snorlax. Don't you snore. Alright, so it hurts itself into confusion. Alright, so we fell down to two. I want to switch out to maybe Cola. I wouldn't mind if Cola. If Cola could survive one hit, or at least Snorlax gets a confusion off, or he wakes up and he uses Snore, we can use uh, something, you know, Left out of confusion. Wow, and he slept out of confusion. But he failed. Okay, so. Count fell to one. Alright, let's uh let's use an item. So let's go to our bag. And use uh which one is for waking up? Antidotes for poison. Uh heals are all statuses of a Pokemon use on. Uh, I guess we can probably go for our gold up right now, and then use it on Daisy the next turn. Yeah, so he withdraws his Snorlax like asshole. This is ridiculous. Goes for the Golem, my lord! I have nothing for this, uh... Well, I mean, I have Lapras, but Lapras won't be, won't be able to survive anything this Golem throws at it. I mean, the uh, Golem. Uh, because it's in the yellow. So can I go for... a Super Potion on my Lapras? the health back up, and maybe use the Super Potion on Golda. So we can actually see what this uh, Golem has. So it has Rock Throw. Uh, definitely kills my Cola. <laughs> it is level 21. Uh, I'm gonna go out into my Lapras. A Golem, I believe, is Rock Ground. 
So it's times four weak to water, right? I think, and ice, uh, if I'm correct. But it's gonna have sturdy, though. Oh, never mind! No, this golem does not have sturdy. Now we just have to deal with this, uh, trolling Snorlax, essentially. Which is really, uh, bugging me. But! But! Here's the but! He can't switch out. No, I will not switch out. Because, everybody, I think, uh, it's pretty obvious what exactly I'm gonna do. We're gonna take this win with a Parish Song. That's right. We are gonna kill this trolling Snorlax and make him taste his own medicine. And it will be delicious. So he's gonna go for the headbutt. Uh, headbutt, do a significant amount of damage. Uh, fell to three. Snorlax Parish, uh, kind of fell to three. I'm gonna go for a Confuse Ray, because why not? And then, uh, I'm gonna go for another Surf. And uh, I think essentially we should be good. I think. I mean, if he wants to rest, that's fine. You know, he'll die to the Parish Song. It's all good. Snorlax hurts himself in the confusion. That's exactly what I wanted. Ha ha ha. And then I'm gonna go for the uh, Surf. Do some uh, more damage. Because why not, ladies and gentlemen? Why not? He's in the yellow. Still confused. Probably gonna hit himself again because he's Snorlax and he's a uh, lazy uh, bum. True. Alright, so we fell to one, and I'm just gonna switch out. That's all I'm gonna do, ladies and gentlemen. That is all I'm gonna do. I'm gonna switch out to my Q-Tip. And I believe my Q-Tip should receive some uh, XP if uh, Snorlax dies right now. Or if I live whatever Snorlax does. I hope he uh, uh, headbutts. Wow, okay. Uh, nope, never mind. Q-Tip is not gonna get any experience, but... But... And this is the huge but. It should die because of Parish Song. Oh, it fell to zero. Oh, I'm dead. I'm a stupid idiot. Oh, take that. Trolling Snorlax. I have no idea how good that felt. That, 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 at least we have something to fill up the episode. Exactly. Well. Uh, what exactly happened? Uh, you're a bad- oh, wait, 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 is he gonna say- I hope I don't- Do you need help with the entrance? Uh, yes. Oh, wow! Wow! Oh, that's cool! So the Machop was like, hey, I need help, and he calls out and Snorlax is like... Uh, ahora si puedes. Alright, so now we can enter this, uh, place. I found a Super Bowl, and there's a Snorlax and a Machop, apparently. Uh, we're gonna go back to the, uh... Healing, uh, at Pokemon Center. I was gonna say Healing Center, what? Hey, yeah, whatever, same thing. Not really, Pokemon Center, all the way. But, uh, jump cut back here again. Whoa, jump cut, and jump cut back in! That's right, no waiting needed. Hello, Machop, you're so helpful. I'm not kidding, that was awesome. Oh, I forgot about the trainers. The sea is like my backyard, let's battle. I am not ready, because I did not grind, so if I lose this battle, whatevs. Let's, let's take on this Surfista Tony. What you got, Tony? A Carvana level 27? Ha! My Daisy laughs at your Carvana. Well, actually, no. I mean, mine's level 24. Uh, but it is weak to grass, and it does take it out, so that's... Muy excelente for my Daisy. Daisy gained some XP. Oh, he only has one Pokemon. Okay. I lost on my home field. I'm in shock. Well, I'm glad. Ha <laughs> ha ha! So that wasn't too bad. There's this giant awesome Snorlax walking around. That, that's so weird to see a giant... Snow likes walking around, but we should see more of those often. It appears we are uh, pretty much these are only trainers we can face, which is fine for now. Uh, face with cyber power, face with the electric soldier. What? You make no sense. You make no sense, NPC. You're not the electric soldier, you're just the rich guy. Rich boy Winston uh, wants to fight, he sends out his Porygon. Hello? Porygon again, no fighting move, but um, it's got overgrow, okay. I think that's going to be quite useful unless you have a grass move, Porygon, but I am going to put you to sleep. Which is uh, vital to what we're trying to do to this Porygon. <laughs> Razor, uh, I don't think Razor Leaf will do much, but uh, we're going to go ahead and do that anyway. You know, we should Leech Seed while we're at it as well. Still asleep. Yeah, I'm going to Leech Seed. Why not? Uh, leech Seed. Uh, there we go. We have Leech Seeded the Porygon. Still asleep. I feel sorry for you, Porygon. I really do. Uh, some damage over time. I, I, I don't know how many Pokemon this person had. Maybe they have two. Uh, but I'm gonna go for another Razor Leaf. And hopefully the trainer doesn't do anything by healing their Pokemon, because that's just mean. 
It's still asleep! The three turns sleep! Wow! We should kill the Porygon now. This is definitely in kill- obviously, definitely in killing distance, my lord. And Rich Boy went straight- wow, really? Well, well, never mind. Never mind. And he's not asleep anymore. What a jerk. He waits for the last second. Oh, but I get a crit, and that is quite lovely. Still with the leech seed damage as well, so take that, Winston. You think you're better than us because you have so much money? I laugh at you. I laugh at you. Take this raised leaf. Hope you die. You're gonna die from the leech seed if you don't live. Uh, if you live the race, but of course you died. But whatever. Blah, 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 blah. You are dead, son. And my Daisy goes to level 25. Good job, Daisy. And I've defeated Rich Boy Winston. Oh, my Cyber Pokemon! Oh, that's why. Now it makes sense, because he used a... Porygon. Not bad, Winston. Just because you have money doesn't make you a good trainer, so... Just saying. So we got more of these rocks. We got some berries over there. We got another Surfista. I see a Chansey is somebody with a... Wow. A uh, Slowpoke. How much uh, did my like? Wow, and my Daisy did an awesome job. Alright, let, let's take you on, brother. Cho Slowpoke. Hey. I'm in the middle of a triathlon, but whatever, let's have a battle. So it's not a surfista, it's gonna be uh, one of those uh, triathletes. No, it's just a surfista, okay. Slow bro. Well. Can I just, can I just sleep powder it, please? Yeah! Sleep powder working wonders. I've hit sleep powder like on every Pokemon, my lord. Daisy, you are the bomb. Thank you. Alright, so we're gonna go for the Razor Leaf. That should do some damage to this Slowbro, no matter how bulky. Especially when we have the sleep, so... Wow, okay, we get the crits. We did more damage than I thought we would do. <laughs> but of course, this trainer's gonna use, uh, let's use, a uh, fucking Cure All Max Potion. Never mind, it's not. Not even a challenge! Doesn't even want to be annoying, because he's like, I'm not a I'm not like that, man. I'm not like a rich boy Winston here. I'm just, I'm just gonna, you know, die with honor. Does that make sense? What? Doesn't die, faint with honor. He ran out of energy, and we defeated the slow bro. So far, so good. Our, uh... Wait, how did we... Okay, so, uh, we're doing some work. It looks like we're gonna have a double battle here. Chansey and whatever else. Uh, no, sorry, Cola. But I am gonna switch Cola with my Lapras. So we shall see. Oh, never mind. I thought it was gonna be a double battle. Wait, maybe? Oh no! Okay, I thought the other trainer was gonna come like, oh, let's do this. But I guess not. That's a triathlete, come on. Come on, Sergio, you know you're triathletes. So, Daisy, for some reason, has been working out quite excellent for me, if I do say so myself. Uh, minimize, and it is done. I, I am done with everything now. I don't wanna do this anymore, because I always miss the first attack. I always miss the first attack. I always miss the first attack of minimize. And to a ground type, it's still gonna do damage if I hit you. Ugh, this is gonna get it real annoying really quick. Use a bubble beam, that should do nothing to me, and I hope we hit you with the razor leaf. Please, come on, it has minimized. Daisy, please hit it. Please, yes, thank you. Thought we were gonna miss it there for a second. I was gonna, I did not want any part of minimized shenanigans. None whatsoever, thank you. So, level 26. Uh, defeated uh, Triathlete, uh, Isaiah, or whatever. My first victory seems to be far away, too. Alright, so Daisy level 26, and uh, okay, well, there you go. I do my triathlon training with Pokemon, so I'm pretty confident about my speed. So it's gonna send out this Chansey, and we are gonna send out the uh, Sleep Powder. True? Yes, very true. Only one Pokemon, so only the Chansey. No, not a Chansey, a Walrein, actually. My, uh, my Daisy does not appreciate any Ice Beams or Aurora Beams this guy might have, but... What is it, Water Ice? I don't know, I have to switch in my Lapras, I really have nothing for you. Uh, Wall Rain. Wow. I guess I could confuse you, but uh... So he sends out the Hail. It's gonna attack us every turn, so... Good... Good play! Good show, lad! Good show. Um... I could be a dick and just go for the pair Song over and over again, right? Wait this three turn out. Just why not? You know what? I'm gonna do it. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. Save the, save us the trouble. We can lose some Pokemon, but it's a guaranteed win for us if you only have one Pokemon. So, uh, uses Aurora Beam. 
Uh, how much? How will we take this as a Lapras? Not, no, not a lot. Wow, okay. The hail still falls, and that's gonna hit us. Pelt us on our head. Oh, never mind. Uh, does hail not uh, affect us when we're water? Yes, I thought it was only ice. So never mind. I had no idea. So uh, we're gonna go for the confuse ray. Confuse this wall rain, because right now he's like, "What the heck's going on? Why is there like musical notes around me? Why is there chickens around me?" And why am I gonna die in or faint in two turns or one turn after this? Well, all, he had to take all of that. It was too overwhelming that he himself. So it makes sense. As hail continues to fall and just be hail. So we're down to two. I really can't do anything like at all to this wall rain. I'm just gonna go for surf. So why not? <laughs> nice and garbage damage. Uh, wall rain snapped out of confusion, and now it's going to it's ice ball. What the heck does ice ball do? Okay. Uh, hail continues to fall. All right, so our uh, parasong is now down to one, and we should um, lose it after this. Uh, what can take a hit? Maybe nothing can take a hit. What? Who do I mind it not uh, pretty pretty much fainting? It's gonna be you have to you, Cola. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Cola. You've been with us since the beginning, but you're gonna have to take this ice ball, bro. I'm so sorry. But you took one for the team, and this wall rain is out. Uh, let's send out Q-tip, right? And uh, give us the experience, right? Right? Yeah, it's gonna give us experience. So our Q-tip gonna turn level 20. All right. And there we go, Lapras. Wow, we're all getting the experience there. Ah, Q-Tip, really? Not get the experience I wanted. Cool, we got some money. And we're gonna face, uh, looks like it's three trainers over there, but we're gonna go back to the Pokemon Center again and jump cut and jump cut back in. So, jump cut! Alrighty then, we are back. That Chansey just chillin'? You just chillin', Chansey? Yeah, Chansey's just chillin'. Um,. We're gonna have to go down there, uh, obviously not a triple battle, but some sort of double battle or some some event, so uh, let's go ahead and, uh, I mean, there's nothing else for us to- Hello? I didn't even know you could encounter Pokemon in this area! Apparently we can, I guess I've just been missing them out, but it's fine, we'll just run away and uh, we'll face whatever we have to face. Uh, let's see what Pokemon do we have. Level 26 Daisy, level 29 Lapras. Uh, is anybody gonna talk to us? No! But we are gonna encounter a Pokemon again. Come on, Trap Inch, just let us leave. Don't tell me you have Arena Trap, or I'm gonna just lose it. Alright, alright. Or has that how Arena Trap works? Uh, Anna, I'm with my pretty junior student partner. I have to do good. Alright, so it is gonna be a double battle or something. I guess we're gonna have to face the other trainer afterwards. Hello, Rangers! What will you guys send out? A Zigzagoon and a Makuhita. Um, it looks okay. I think we can handle this. All right. So, uh, Daisy, what are you going to do? As Daisy, I'm just going to um. Wait, hello. Razor Leaf. I don't get to choose. Okay, fine. Oh, does Razor Leaf hit uh, both teammates? I don't know that. Yes, it does. All right. So, uh, pretty weak team. Uh, really. I don't know why it's like that. I, I maybe. They forgot to edit the Pokemon trainers with uh, proper Pokemon, proper levels as well, because that was almost too easy. So, um, Daisy gained a significant amount of uh, not even a significant amount of experience. That was like a hundred. That was nothing. So, quite easy, and I'm gonna guess there's a third person here that we're gonna talk to right now. Hello, Meg, I dragged Anna down. If I didn't, she would have won. What are you? Oh, okay, so we faced two girls on the side, now we're facing... The aroma of flowers has a magical power. It cleanses us body and soul. Oh no. It's a beauty. And as we all know, we know exactly be beauties mean trouble. What? Wow. No, we are done. We have nothing for this Venusaur. We have nothing for this Venusaur. Wow, beauties would do this to me, huh? Nope. Ladies and gentlemen, we are gonna lose. There's nothing we have. 
um, Ice Beam, but I'm uh, Lapras is weak to water. I mean, water grass, so I'm pretty sure that Venusaur is going to take us out. The thing we can probably hope for is survive what this Venusaur does to us. No! Venusaur's thinking the same thing I'm thinking. He wants to go for the sleep powder, so there goes that plan. Um, and, and, and our Golduck uh, could do some damage with Confusion, but... Again, it's weak to grass, so I'm pretty much screwed here. I mean, Sweet Scent, okay, fine. What is it? My evasiveness fell, so I can take more Sleep Powders, that's fine. Uh, don't attack me, I really don't know what, it has Razor Leaf, so it's the same as I am. But it's, it's like, it's gonna, yeah. Wow, that was a crit? Okay, so I could probably survive a couple more hits. I don't think I'm ever gonna pull off the Sleep Powder switcheroo with Ice Beam and, uh, Lapras or Confusion and uh, Golduck. I woke up and I used Sleep Powder. Thank God. Can you just stay asleep, Venusaur? Venusaur! Venusaur, if you go to sleep, Venusaur, if you stay asleep for just one turn or a couple turns for me to just use Ice Beam Mom on. Come on, Venusaur. You'll be on my team. Brother, you are on my team! What are you doing? Alright, Ice Beam, please. Stay asleep, Venusaur. Take this ice beam, Venusaur. Please. And just die. Get a crit. Get a crit, please. No, this is really bulky, Venusaur, my lord. Really bulky. Still asleep, but let's hope you can get a crit, because I don't think we're going to kill it on the next move. It's going to be in red, like a 2 HP or something along those lines. Please kill it. I, what did I say, ladies and gentlemen? I was right. I was absolutely right. But let's hope we're faster. No, we're not. I use Razor Leaf. That's probably gonna take us out. Let's hope it doesn't. Uh, Lapras, take it, take it, Lapras. Lapras, you took it, Lapras. Alright. Beauty, goodbye, and good luck. Um, there goes that Venusaur. Okay, uh, Daisy, level 27. Good job, Daisy. Lapras gaining some uh, more uh, XP. Rose is about to send out a uh, Meganium? Oh, beauties. Beauties are probably the toughest trainer in this entire hack. They've been giving me problems since day one. What do I have for this? I don't think I have anything. Send out Cola. Send out Cola. Heal up our Lapras. Heal up our uh, Daisy. Wow. Meganium and a Venusaur. I have no words. I have no words, honestly. Uh, we can probably pair song with our Lapras, so that's what I'm thinking of. But we need to- Oh, it has poison power! I see you, Meganium! At least it's not Sleep Powder, right? So this is probably the toughest trainer I've faced yet. I feel like I'm in a, a gym battle right now. So, um, let's heal up our Lapras more. Because why not, right? Our Lapras, and if we have another turn, we'll heal up our Daisy. So we're gonna see in a moment. Uh, it has Reflect! Interesting, okay, so I mean, uh, shouldn't be too bad. I mean, I'm not gonna attack you physically. All I want is to survive uh, with Lapras enough to do a Parish Song. Um, but we're gonna go ahead, go to our bag, use our fifth, uh, apparently our number five, Super Potion, heal up our Daisy. Uh, synthesis, alright, so it can heal up. Uh, so it has Reflect, Poison Power, Synthesis, it has to have some sort of grass move. I'm waiting for that, but so far, nothing. Uh, oh, wow, we could use that, but it's okay. I don't know what Fake Tears does. I don't, what does Fake Tears do? Does anybody know? I forgot what this move does. I guess I should have checked it out. That lowers down the special defense. Okay, so that's cool. Partially fell. That's that's awesome, actually. I'm going to keep doing that. Because of... Um, Meganium, you're not even attacking me. Do you have no... Grass move whatsoever. I gave him special defense. Harshly fell. We're probably gonna take it. Uh, we know what I want to do. I want to take it down with hopefully just one ice beam. Oh, there you go. It has body slam. So we can definitely take this up, Meganium out with an ice beam, I think. So we're gonna go ahead and do that because there is no grass move this Meganium has. It has poison powder, reflect, synthesis, and body slam. So. Ice Beam should take care of it since it's minus four special defense. It's gonna go for uh, Poison Powder and me, but uh, Lapras don't give a crap. 
uh, take this Ice Beam Meganium and completely get obliterated and decimated and criminated and destructionated and all the aided you can take. Ah, uh, Lapras, my trusty friend, my trusty fellow. I have defeated the beauty. I have defeated the beauty. So, let us jump cut back, because we're not done on this road to revenge. Come we're going to take down that other dumb trainer, shall we? Let us go, jump cut right to him. And we are back. Uh, what Pokemon did he send out first? I completely forgot. We're going to go for Daisy, and we're going to destroy this ranger, hopefully. He has six Pokemon. I'm ready to take you on. Oh, you have a big collection of gym badges. Shut up. Shut up. This is a road to redemption. We're trying to end Pokemon Orange with... Good feelings. Look at this cocky guy. Cool trainer Clyde. Man, you don't even know, son. You don't even know. Whoops, kind of a uh, sped up there. But we're going to take him down. Nice and easy with a Thunderbolt. Should be okay. Just decimated completely. Get away from me, you dumb bird. Uh, ha 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 ha. Ha 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 ha. Alright, so there it goes. Alright, uh, what are we gonna have next? Trap Inch. Will I switch Pokemon? Yes, I will. I'll switch to my Lapras, so destroy this Trap Inch. Level 30 Lapras. I'm gonna send out your puny level 11. <laughs> I'm a cool trainer. That's what I'm associated with. My coolness. I'm an idiot. Yes, you are. Yes, you are, Clyde. You're a complete idiot. That's right. I'm I'm talking directly to you, friend. I'm talking directly to you. Uh, Swift Tree. That's that one grass uh, guy, right? I well, switch Pokemon. No, I'll stay in. I'll completely destroy you with an Ice Beam. I think, right? If you're grass, you should be taken down like completely right now. Goodbye. All right. So there goes Swift Tree. Uh, gain some, uh, XP. He's about to use Magneton. This is the guy that took me down. Well, guess what, Magneton? Guess what? You're gonna take some, uh, uh some uh, fake tears. Uh, two, hopefully. I can land two, and that would be awesome, actually. Oh, it doesn't have six. He has five, but regardless. Fake tears, this guy. Lower down its special defense. So we can at least do some damage with Lapras. Uses T-Wave, of course. The good old paralyzing, of course. I'm gonna use a Sonic Boom. Still does a lot, my lord. Go for some more fake tears. Hopefully I can go for at least one more without getting hacks or killed, right? Um, so let's go for that. Uh, uses another Sonic Sonic Boom! Uh, I'm paralyzed, of course, so I'm not gonna survive any of this. Uh, great. Just great. I, I can only get it to minus four special defense, but... Let us continue, shall we? Alright, so... <laughs> Lapras, can you take a T-Ball? Please! Take it out. With something. Take it out with Ice Beam. Let's, do, let's just do Ice Beam. I mean, you're at minus four, Magneton. I really have nothing that can really destroy you, so... And there you go! Nice and destroyed! <laughs> I think I was all worried about this guy, just because I couldn't have nothing to damage it with. A Whalmer, yes, I will switch out to... I'll switch out to my Daisy. Daisy will do some work to this Whalmer, and that should be it! He finally destroyed this cool trainer guy. He's like, uh, I'm gonna set up my magnet son, because that's the only thing that can protect me. Durr. Goodbye, Wilmer. It was nice knowing you, buddy. Wilmer's actually one of my favorite Pokemon. Well, at least design-wise. I, I like it. I like the whales. I have a soft spot for whales. And that's all it is, ladies and gentlemen. So we can finally explore this island that I've been neglecting to even search, because I've been literally... I didn't come to this island because of this reason. Ah! Let's just let's just explore and not encounter stuff. So I'm just gonna cut it. Whatever. What is going on? So this is Mr. Briny's house in a completely different place, and apparently I have that letter that happens in uh, Pokemon Ruby and Sapphire and Emerald. And it, all the all the everything's everything's unchanged. He's chasing around his uh, Wingle, his Pico, or whatever that we saved from that one cave in the Pokemon Ruby Sapphire ele uh, ele ele element, Emerald. Um. Uh, do you want to sail to do for it? I'm kind of afraid to do this option. Let me save off screen and then let me click yes, shall we? I went on the strangest ride. Apparently, 
it glitches throughout the entire map. I wish I could show it, but I, it would really defeat the purpose of this Pokemon Orange hack. Trust me. I mean, it just... Basically, it's an unedited, kind of crazy, bizarro world version of the Pokemon Gen 3 location. Sorry, I forgot the name! But we're gonna have to say no, because it just... It kind of, uh... It, 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 it was insane, so, um, it, it's just gonna take too much of the episode. Trust me, I know you guys want to see it, but it's pretty much an unedited version. That's all you guys are gonna missing, and missing tiles here and there. And, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. Alright then. No! I will not, Mr. Briny. Yes, Mr. Briny, I uh, don't want to do that, but let's cut into the actual hack of the game and uh, finish the final location, shall we? Alright, we're back! We're just gonna take down this Gorbis, which apparently lives in the ocean. Had no idea because of the giant amount of Corsolas. Corsolas apparently are the tentacles or tentacles of this hack. Um, sorry, Gorbis, I have no need for a water Pokemon right now because we are on a mission to finally complete. Oh, where's that cursor come from? Hello, nice and sloppy. Okay, so we're finally back into this cave, ladies and gentlemen, and we can finally use. Let's look at our Pokemon. Oh, you have an item. Let's uh, take something from Cola. All right, uh, uh, Flash. Woohoo! We can finally see uh, everything, which is insane. I mean, I kind of had everything memorized so far, but uh, it's all right. We're gonna go where we need to go, which is over here. Ah, the sound was a mile. Did you want to have some fun? Then you have it. What? Who said that? I didn't say that. Um, but like I was saying, the final area, basically, of this hack, um, suffice to say, which is kind of sad because, I mean, I was enjoying everything. You know? I really was. I'm just gonna run away. I really have no reason to fight this Mawile. Um, it's coming to an end, and I found an Everstand. Too bad that- what? Really? The bag is full? Wow. Okay. You get a crumb. Too bad the bag is full. Alright, that is a rare candy. Can we just, uh, go into our bag and get rid of, uh, what do we have? What do we have? <laughs> uh, something really dumb, like, uh, use this protein on, uh, what does protein do? Attack. Okay, yeah, let's raise the attack. Why not? Uh, what else? What else? Don't we have iron somewhere around here? The speed- raise the speed stat of one Pokemon. Let's raise the speed stat of... Uh, why not? Why not? Why not? Let's just give them all away, because we're at the end of the game. Stuff- items we never use. Sad, sad story, everybody. Let's just- Let's give it another one to Daisy. Why not? Let's go, Daisy. And uh, let's get uh, let's get ourselves a rare candy and use that as well. All right, caramelo raro. All right, so we're gonna obviously rare candy like I explained the other time. Uh, go into our bag, get that rare candy, use that sucker. Why not use it on Daisy? Nice and Daisy. All right, all right. Let's continue uh, towards this cave. Oh, apparently we're encountering probably you know the same old cave people uh, from the cave like I said, cave people. Yes, cave people, Jamie. No, a uh, cave Pokemon. We're gonna basically run away from everything. We're gonna... I don't know where to go. I don't know where I'm going. <laughs> uh, keep continuing. I hate caves. We're gonna use a Super Repel, because I, I really don't care about Pokemon right now. Not at all. Let's just, let's just end this. Let's, let's use that, shall we? Let's go to do our... Use our... We only have two Super Repels. Oh, well. Alright, uh... Find out exactly where we need to go, because I have no idea. I really have no idea. I, I kind of misjudged how big this place was going to be. Alright, so we found... I don't know what that is. <laughs> Alright, so we got that. Can we go up here? Yeah, right? I believe we can. Alright, um... Man, this cave system goes on for days, huh? All these kabutops or kabutos lining the walls. Uh, are we gonna be back where we started? Probably. Yes, we are. Nice and full circle of nothing. Alright, so I'm gonna go in the other direction now then. But there's still other 
other directions for us to go. So this is kind of confusing. Is this a dead end? No, it leads to something. Okay. I don't know where I'm going, honestly. Uh. 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 <laughs> oh. What? <laughs> We're sequestered in this dark uh, place with also dark fat guys. I'm not even gonna question how that happened, but okay. Call Team Rocket. We are watching how they t the attack off the cave's fossils. They're trying to take the cave's fossils. Focus on me, says James. We dedicate our robbery to our great boss, Giovanni. Yeah, stop your sucking up, boss. When you see this, we want you to know this was all mine. No, when Jesse gets in front of a cat? Come on. You know that the boss likes me the best, but you know I'm the leader of this team. Stop recording that as stupid report right now, as stupid, really? Spanglish? Oh, apparently I'm the one saying stuff. Ah, do you want some trouble? Then make it double. To protect the world from devastation, to unite the people within our nation, to defeat the enemies of truth and love, to extend our borders to the stars above, Jesse James. Team Rocket blast off at the speed of light. Surrender now, we're prepared to fight, fight, fight! Oh, come on, meow! That's right! And the reporter's like, bravo, bravissimo, really good! And we are facing Jesse and James together at last. No, that is not Jesse and James. What? <laughs> I guess they couldn't edit the two, uh... The two guys together? Okay, that's fine. Um, weird glitch. I'm gonna guess that's supposed to be Jesse and James showing up, not this surfer dude guy. Um, let's handle this uh, dust skull apparently and coughing. So many glitches within five minutes of this game. Uh, starting. Okay, whatever. This cave. All right. So I'm just gonna go ahead and uh, razor leaf. Uh, just gonna go ahead and surf. Razor leaf. We can handle any of these guys. Yes, it doesn't do much damage, but you know. It, some damage is any damage, really. Lapras is gonna use some Surf. Do some more damage. Some more damage. Ooh. Coughing's not liking that. Going for the Smog on my Lapras. It's gonna get poisoned. Yep. Alright. It eh, shouldn't be too bad. Lapras is hurt of poison. Just uh, keep spamming the same button. Going for Razor Leaf. I know it's not very effective, but I'm just gonna stay in because it's my strongest Pokemon. But it does take out the coughing, so at least there's that. So now we gotta deal with this Duskull, aka Arbak. Uh, Lapras gains some XP. And I'm gonna use some Surf. And that should be it. We have taken down Jesse and James. Don't know why it was like, hey, Jace, Jesse and James again, what have we done to deserve this? <laughs> The glitches are real, ladies and gentlemen. Team Rocket is blasting off again! <laughs> Alright. Uh, this report is the greatest. Uh-oh. Uh, what was that? This game is collapsing! Bring the, some, the escape rope. Escape rope. Oh, right. Uh, I do have an escape rope. I like how they didn't spawn us outside, though. Uh, let's just use this on our Lapras, because why not? We don't need no escape rope, we're gonna escape this cave on a very nice climax, like Indiana Jones, because this is Pokemon Orange. And that's been pretty much it, I think. As far as that, that's that's all there is. As far as I know, this game has been untouched for about four to five years. I don't think it's ever gonna get made, ladies and gentlemen. So let's just escape this cave like a, like a boss, and uh, we should be fine. <laughs> Um, I mean, is there other areas we can explore of this cave? You know, that I know of. I mean, there's there's this where we came. I mean, let's check the other side, shall we? Or other locations. Uh, we can't go down that way. What about this way? Because I'm pretty sure we didn't go this way. What is this? Why does it look like that? Uh... Okay. So they're holes. Alright, so don't fall. Uh, that'll be fine. Okay. 
Um, we have defeated Jesse James from stealing the Kabutops, and it actually looks like it might be nearing the end of the game. Um, I'm almost sad. There's nothing else to do. No! No! Are these holes? Are we just gonna go through all these holes? Apparently. Hold on, just stay with me for a second. Well, it looks like there is one last thing to do, and I kind of want to end it there. No! I was gonna open why did it affect- what? What the heck? Where are we? What? What? I, I was trying to go upstairs. Why did I- why did I do this? I just want to end it in a nice place if uh, you catch my drift. So, uh, I to look at Naranja's fucking help files here to know exactly what I'm doing. I have no idea what I'm doing. Go up here. Then we go here. And then we go here. N oh, that scared me. I thought I was gonna fall down a pit or something. No, we did not fall down a pit. We just encountered a level 11 Makuhita. So let's just run away from this because there's actually something pretty interesting that I want to show you guys. Uh, if this game would just stop. Stop with the Pokemans. I really wish I had another sort of repel, because it's just ridiculous. Come on. Um, okay, well. Welp. Welp. Uh, send out our daisy. Wow, okay. <laughs> I want to show you guys something cool, so let's just speed on up on over here. Out of this cave. Uh, some weird person there. Alright. Alright! We get it already! Ah, man. Alright, um, keep on going, keep on going, because I do want to show you guys something cool. Oh! Ah, too bad. I didn't even know you were in this cave. Well, I, well, actually, the original, you are in the cave, so I guess I was just surprised, because you don't, you don't appear all that often anymore. This is what I'm going to show you guys. Uh, yeah, we're gonna end it here. Very beautiful place. Outside of the mountain at night with a nice pink moon. A good way to sum up Pokemon Orange. I, I, what can I say? As far as uh, beginning Beta 2 hat goes, the introduction is amazing. The first two gyms is fun. Lots, lots of awesome, great events. Butch and Cassidy, Jesse and James, following the Orange Islands. I wish this game was finished. Sergio, if you're out there, if you're watching this video, I would really appreciate if you finish this, because I know I would definitely want to get those last two badges. But thus ends this adventure of Pokemon Orange. I'm so glad for all the support everybody has shown me and for watching this series. We've had some laughs, we've had some struggles, but it has finally come to an end in this beautiful, beautiful landscape, so to speak. As always, I've been Cooliewiz, and I will see you guys later.